right. You I, think I you have the you, you think you have the freedom of speech? Uh, well, to an extent. To an extent. So it has been deprived, has it not? Well, I think that's how it is in any business, though, right? In any business. What do we call it? business? Commerce. Okay. Commerce. Right? You're doing commerce, aren't you? In what sense? Aren't you in the business of providing protection and service in exchange for money? For profit or personal gain? You got me. That's what we call commerce, isn't yeah, it, Corporal? You're right. You're right. It is a right? job. And whenever you volunteer to do a job, you put somebody above you, don't you? Like always. Somebody that can tell you how to dress, what to say. Well, they and they can. And they can. Yeah, yeah. But you've given them that authority, have you not? Yes. Right? As long as I'm employed here. As yes. long as you're employed. Correct. And if you want your rights, you can quit. Uh-huh. And then you will have your rights again. But right now, you don't have rights. Well, you don't get have. to go press. You don't get to assemble and hold a F the cop sign on the corner now, do you? I mean, yeah, you're right about I'm that. I'm damn straight I'm right. Yeah. And you know why? Because I'm one of the people. And you're a servant of the people. Yes. And the Constitution clearly defines what you are. You are a person. Okay. And persons don't have rights. Okay. Nowhere in the Constitution does it say persons have rights. Do you want me to go tell Officer Avila he has no rights? Uh, he has one right, but none of you seem to know what it is. What is it? The right to vote. It was. Oh, no, sir. I need to search you for officer safety. You knew the job was dangerous when you took it, Fred. Officer safety? What a joke. Next thing you know, you'll say that you fear for your life and you pull out your gun and try to shoot me. Don't forget to like and hit that subscribe button.